Hey everyone, Joe Hain here, and today I'm gonna to explain in just a few minutes how the law of attraction works and how you can use it to be successful in anything you dream of. So if you're looking to land that dream job, get the romantic partner, experience a boost in your health or wealth or whatever it is, you can use these three principles of the law of attraction to ensure your success and manifest the success that you wish in your life in any realm. Before we break down those three vital components to ensure your success, please be sure to subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it and look forward to helping you along your way. First things first, let's break down those three steps. The first one being, you have to know how the law of attraction works. Basically, it's what you think about, what you speak out loud, what you feel, and what you work towards is what you're going to attract into your life. So your thoughts, your spoken word, and your feelings or emotions, and your hard work has the ability to manifest anything that you want to occur in your reality. So let's say I wanna run a marathon in under three hours. First things first, I need to think about, to speak about, and to feel that I can achieve that goal. Step two is to evaluate my life. If I wanna run that marathon in under three hours, what am I doing each and every single day that helps me achieve that goal? And what am I doing that's preventing me from achieving that goal? So we're breaking it down. What am I doing with my thoughts, my spoken word, and my feelings and my actions every single day? Do I feel like I'm less than? Do I feel and think about how I will never achieve success in running under three hours? That's impossible. I just don't have the body type for it. I don't have the endurance. Am I telling other people, yeah, I'm gonna pursue this goal, but I just don't think it's gonna work out? And am I working towards it? Am I sitting on the couch and eating junk food? Or am I training? Am I out there running? And do I feel down if I feel angry? anxiety or stress or depression or sadness or even just a great amount of pressure that I don't really like and that's not comfortable for achieving this goal. Am I feeling that and letting those thoughts and words and, and actions just kind of saturate my day? Or is it the opposite where I'm thinking and saying and feeling great things about myself achieving that goal of running the marathon in less than three hours? Do I think good things like I can do this, I deserve this and tell other people that I'm working really hard and training to achieve this goal and that I'm really excited about it and I know that I can do it. Do I feel good and inspired? So step three is affirmations. You're going to affirm your success. You're gonna speak it in your mind mentally saying, I have run that marathon in under three hours. I am energized and I'm capable, I'm energetic and it's just an easy task for me. And you're gonna think these things in, in your mind every morning and every evening. And then you're gonna state them out loud too. This is called affirmations. You're affirming your success as if it's already happened. I am prosperous. I have run that marathon in under three hours. You're stating in present tense as if it's already been settled. And you're gonna have a feeling of emotion, of genuine gratitude for having achieved that goal already. You're gonna see yourself on the podium being awarded that medal. You're gonna see yourself celebrating with friends and family. You're gonna see yourself crying. That all that hard work and all that belief in yourself helped you to achieve your goal. And you're standing there and you're a testimony to that. And that you're going to let that genuine emotion flow through you while you're speaking these things in your mind and out loud. So that feeling of emotion, that gratitude flowing and surging through you is like wind in your sails. You're gonna use that emotion while declaring your success mentally and out loud. Those are the steps, they're straightforward. You gotta believe in yourself and you gotta speak about it, you gotta think about it, you gotta work towards it and feel empowered. That's probably one of the most difficult parts for people is to believe in themselves and have faith that they are of value, that they are worthy of their dreams and desires, that they, they deserve that success. So believe in yourself. Manifestation takes time. Success is a habit, it is not a coincidence. So achieving these things, these daily habits that affirmations and speaking about and thinking about and pursuing your goals is an everyday occurrence. You wanna make it part of your routine, just like brushing your teeth and drinking water throughout the day. These affirmations and this belief will ripple out into the universe and you will manifest the success that you dream of. So be faithful, be patient, and be vigilant because manifestation does take a bit of time. It's not immediate. It could take three to 12 months depending on how big the scope is of your dreams and pursuits, but 
your persistence is key. Believe in yourself and use these techniques each and every day and you are sure to see your success in whatever you dream of. Thank you guys for watching. Please be sure to subscribe. Helps my channel out and I really help helping you guys out. Please give this video the thumbs up if you think I deserve it. And I ask everybody at the end of my videos, please do something kind for someone else. It will be sure to make their day and your day as well. And thank you for watching. And if you wanna learn a little bit more about me, please watch this intro. And thanks guys, we'll see you on the next video. Hi there, my name is Joe Hain, and after suffering a tremendously difficult personal loss, I quit life as I knew it and began traveling the world, delighting in new and thrilling cultures and helping along the way where I could. Through endless hours of meditation, pouring over hundreds of books, and delving into the depths of my own mind, I finally discovered what I've been looking for, peace, purpose, and joy. I'm here to share what I've learned so that you too can discover all that I've come to know. So let's get to it and have a bit of fun along the way.